Hi there, um, I'm going to show you how to change this sort of uh, artist website setup with uh, images on the side and this uses something called Simple Viewer. Now um, when you log into your website you will see something like this uh, with options down the side. Now most of the things you want to do will be in this area which is called Pages. So we, if we click on Pages we'll see um, something like this which has a list of all the pages that appear up here on your menu. Um, now we want to change this one called figurative painting. Um, now the other the other pages are quite simple. If you look at this page called contact, um, we open it up, we get this sort of um, page and it's a very simple page. It, it just has some information and we can type in here um, whatever we like and um, we can click update and that will that will appear. Um, but with the images it's a little bit different. Um, if we look at figurative painting we have a page like this and there's nothing, there's no images here um, so how do we, um, what do we do? We just have this strange code here. Well fortunately you don't have to touch anything here, this, this just automatically works. All you need to do is worry about this button here which says add media. So let's click on add media, what do we see? Um, it says insert media and it gives us some different um, things. Um, up here this is your media library which has everything that you've uploaded to your website and if we click this little doubt this little option here we can just select uploaded to this page. Now we can see here is a, a group of images and it's the same group that is here so that means that anything that you add to this page Anything you add to um, your figurative page will show up in your menu. That's, that's all we have to do is upload it. Um, okay, so let's do that. If we see here it says upload files, we'll click on that. And we'll click on select files. We just have to find a image. I'm going to just use any, um, any image here, someone else's image. Um, I'll click open. Now that is appearing in this grid. Um, now we don't have to do anything else. Um, once it's uploaded, uh, that's all you need to do. The only other thing you might want to do is change the order. You might not want that to be the first work in your thumbnails. You might drag this to make it the last, maybe the last work. And while you're there, you might decide instead of this green work, maybe you want this bunny rabbit work to be the first work. So you can arrange these however you like. If you want to add some titles, uh, some uh, like some uh, cap work captions, over here in the captions area you can say new work um, plaster 2014 and that will be um, added to your work as well. You can see here it says saved. Um, now we close this, that's all you need to do, don't, you don't need to insert anything, you just close this with this little cross here. Now nothing has changed, all we need to do is press update and that saves our um, changes. So we click update. Now we'll go back to that page. Now um, nothing seems different, so what we have to do is we have to reload this page. Um, and we have to clear our cache. If you don't know what a cache is, um, find, uh, find out online. Um, but a cache is just a memory uh, that the computer has. So I've, I've pressed a button here to clear the cache. Um, if you don't clear your cache, then it will just um, probably change uh, by itself just, um, just after a while. Um, so let's reload that and see if we've got our changes. Just loading. There we are, the rabbit is now the first work, and that's what we wanted. Um, the green work has gone to the second place. Now, because we've cleaned our cache, it's forgotten the memory, so it's taking a while to reload all of these while it remembers all of these um, works for the first time. And if we go right down, here we are on the second page, there's this work here. So that's the work we've just uploaded. Uh, and there's the title underneath the work. Um, I hope that makes sense and um, let me know if you have some problems.